We are gonna have a little fun now, and if you love to fry, but you cannot stand the mess, I'm gonna tell you a quick story. The other night, I made coconut shrimp with my friend Ken. We were in the kitchen, he demanded that we fry them and not bake them, because the instructions say fry. So I got a frying pan, filled it with half of an inch of oil, and when I tell you, it was like it exploded all over the kitchen. You never get rid of the odor, you never get rid of the smell. This, I think, conceivably, is one of the lowest priced fryers we have offered you. It's from Bella. There are only 1,800 of them. I predict this is going bye-bye. It is on two flex payments. Your first flex payment will be $20. Your second, uh, second flex payment will be $19.99 plus tax and shipping, of course, for the first. But this is what you can do, is you can get gooey mozzarella sticks and chicken wings and mini egg rolls and french fries. Kelly? I'm sorry, I had to this get into the mozzarella because, I mean, sorry, there's nothing better than ooey gooey delicious fried mozzarella. But here's the thing about frying. You want to do it the right way. That's what Bill was talking about. He did it the wrong way. He did it over the uh. stove top. Not only is it a hot mess, literally, but it's not quite as healthy because when you do frying the wrong way, oil soaks into the food and then you ingest that oil. That's not what you want. What you want is the Bella Fryer, which I keep it at the exact perfect right temperature to fry your foods instantly and let's be honest it's frying but you're going to do it a little bit healthier because you're doing it right it's not soaking up that oil this is why every <laughs> right? human being on planet earth that likes crispy and gooey loves a deep fryer mm -hmm. because if you try this in a frying pan it's going to absorb all the oil this will quickly fry the outside and let the cheese be molten on the inside but that's just one of many reasons now okay also, cooking faster, right? Yes, you're going to be cooking things in two minutes, three minutes, four minutes, as opposed to getting out of the fryer, uh, frying pan, putting it on the stovetop as he goes in for the cheese, <laughs> by the way. But you're going to be doing things instantly in two minutes. Again, it's the right way to do it. So if you're going to fry, which we all do, we all love that crispy crunchy, delicious fried flavor. Do it with the Bella Fryer because it comes with a basket that pops right on out. We make life easy because this basket can be thrown directly into the dishwasher. Right. The handle folds all the way onto the inside. Also at the bottom of our units, it's not going to burn. You see, it goes, all of the little crumbs and the drips will go underneath the heat thermometer so you don't get that burn taste, that burnt flavor. And when you have a fryer like this one that goes all the way up to 375 degrees, which fries at the perfect temperature, you're going to be frying things fast. How about what Bill's revealing Are these here? done? These are almost, yeah, these are okay. done. You're right, they're golden I, brown. Let me tell you how much I love. Homemade French fries. Homemade. Homemade. I don't like the bag fries. When you take the skin, and you cut these into like six or, or eight. That. That's a French fry. Yes, in ketchup is. or mayonnaise or both. All right, let me make a recommendation. This is the first presentation of the day. It's $39.99. This is not like you have to make some big decision here. But now you'll have that fryer. Even if you don't want to fry inside, bring it out to the patio under cover. It has all the safety features you expect of a fryer. It has that magnetic breakaway plug so that let's say you've got wild children or pets running around the kitchen and they come by and they hit the power cord, it won't pull the fryer to the floor, it'll knock the power cord off. That's right. And here's what else I love about Bella. You saw that I just covered it. And both of these, you can actually, they have indentation. So I can actually cover my fryer while I'm frying. Mm. There's a filter right here so you don't get as many frying odors. And then what I also love is that it's clear right up at the top here. I can peek in and make sure that that I'm not frying for oh. too long. Most things take two Wait. or three minutes, but I can peek in and make sure that it's not going for too long. And of course, I have that temperature control, which goes from 275 to 375. Okay, see, this There's is... There's the coconut look, shrimp that Bill ruined. This is the way you're supposed to make coconut <laughs> shrimp, not have it all over the backsplash of your kitchen. And look how golden brown and crispy those are. Okay, listen, I'm going to recommend that you use express ordering or you go to hsn.com. These are flawless. Every one of these delicious shrimp are to perfection. I'm going to put some chicken strips. Yes, please. Are these chicken or fish? Those are chicken. Chicken? chicken? Okay. Yep. Do you put them in the basket and the basket you in? You put the basket and lean the basket on the edge, just like that, so oh, it's up and okay. out of the oil, and then you pop it inside there. Oh. But look at my fried green beans, Bill, that I just did. Crunchy to perfection. That was so about a minute easy. and a half. Look at that crunch. So if you're going to do vegetables, why not fry them? But fry them the right way. I just did my fried green beans. Now a lot of Ooh, these come Oh, I love these. Try one. A lot of these come straight Ooh. out of the...
freezer section at your grocer. So they're not difficult to do. You don't have to sit around and make the batter and do all kinds of things. Buy these straight out of the grocery. Okay. Okay. Let you me tell you something. Crunch when I bit into that. You know what? You don't feel so guilty when you're frying green beans. <laughs> you so feel true. like you're not. You're eating your greens. You're just getting a little something, something extra. Yeah, I am. That is such a good statement. You oh don't feel so bad. This is unreal. Absolutely. Now look at our churros. Mm. We just got our churros out. They're crunchy and perfect. How about desserts? You can do all kinds of desserts. Oh, wait a minute. Slow down. What is this? These are churros. You've ever had churros? It's like a Mexican dessert that you put with cinnamon. Churros? It's, like, it's basically like fried dough. <laughs> Perfect. Which, how can you go wrong with fried dough? But that's the thing that Bella allows you to do. You can read this, this, uh, this oil will recover very, very quickly. So I can now pop in something else. I'm going to just salt these a little. Not salt them, but give it a little um, oh, dust them with powdered them. sugar. Mm. But when's the last time you were able to do homemade churros at home? Now you can do it because you have the proper tools. You wouldn't dare try that, like, say, on a stovetop or in a frying machine. You really wouldn't bake them. You don't want to bake churros. Can I tell you, I'm just having a moment here because that <laughs> fried green bean was so tender on the inside but so crispy on the outside. Let me recommend you try this. If you've never deep fried, flash fried, and you've tried to do it with chicken in a frying pan, you know what kind of a splattering mess that is. Get yourself a fryer. They're $39.99. It's from Bella. You know what? I was in the grocery, the, the big box store, and it was back, uh, gosh, three, four months ago, before I think we took inventory of Bella products, and I saw this beautiful, crisp, red coffee pot, and I bought it. Then I'm on HSN.com and I see <laughs> Bella Coffee Pot and it was less money. It was $34.95. Check it out at our website at HSN.com. But in the meantime, fried chicken strips, egg rolls, fried green beans, that mozzarella, unbelievable. I have to have a french fry. Please have the homemade french fries. Those are golden, crispy, brown to perfection. It's the way to do french fries. If you've never done it, you slice a potato, you put it inside the fryer. Mm. Here's everything that you get, because this is such a great configuration. First of all, it's a really sleek, nice looking stainless steel fryer. Love that about Bella. All they do is have fun in the kitchen. I love, love, love that. Then here's the great thing about the fryer. The heating element comes straight out. This is so easy to clean. Most fryers, the heating element is attached. So you actually can't get this out and pour the oil. This comes right on out of here. You Mother. pour your oil. You can actually reuse your oil, pour it through a cheesecloth, straighten your oil, and then pop this in the dishwasher bill. Just rinse it out. It's so easy to clean. I and mean, then next time you go for it, you just pop the heating element the right back that in. The element goes into the deep fryer. Listen, this is the difference between deep frying and frying in a frying pan. Yes. When, you have, when you're deep frying and the element is at the bottom and plus you have a basket, all of the little particles of the dough and the coatings, they, they simmer to the bottom of the pan. So you're not preparing food in all the burning particles of dough and all of the burning particles of the batter. That's number one. When you're using a frying pan, everything's being cooked right at the same level. Mm -hmm. Have you ever put a pork chop in a frying pan and the coating just kind of floats to the side? That's because of the condensation when it hits the heat. Call us, try one. You might be thinking for $39.95, what can this be? This, I've been eating for the first 10 minutes and everything I put in my mouth is scrumptious, not, not soaking in fat, and I have to try a shrimp. And listen to these. I'm going to pull out one of these egg rolls. It's hot, but I'm going to take one for the team because I want you to hear how crispy, how delicious. Can you actually hear? Mmm. How crispy. Mm. Try an egg roll in the fryer next time. Don't mm. put it in the microwave. Don't put it in the oven where it's soft and squishy. Now you get that crisp, that crunch, that literally you can see it flaking apart in my hands. That's what happens when you use the right tools. Just look at this egg roll. It's crispy on the outside, but because we have it at the perfect temperature, it's nice and moist on the inside. The vegetables aren't soaked in oil, but the outside is crispy and crunchy. That's what we love about fried foods. Listen. And you want to do it right. Do you hear this? Do you hear that crunch? This is a fried string bean. <laughs> String beans aren't supposed to be I hear if you fry a green bean, there's no calories. <laughs> you know what? Try it for the new year when the kids come home and you want to do fish sticks or you want to do fried cheese sticks. Or you know what? You have friends or family come over and you want to do a homemade cuisine that's different than anything else you've had all you know month long. Try making homemade you know, egg rolls. Have fun with it. Donuts. Donuts in the morning. Oh, my I, God. In about three minutes, I just did these perfect...
golden brown donuts along with our churros, drizzle them in powdered sugar, give it a little bit of chocolate sauce. You're about to do homemade onion fries. Can I help you? Please add okay. the onion fries on in so there. So now how do you do this while we're doing it since I'm yeah, watching? Yeah, you just pop it right over here. Let me put the basket up. So you okay. take the basket and you leave oh. it up and out of the fryer. Oh, okay. It has the little ledge there where you set it. You put them all in? And then you put your food in. Yeah, you fill the bottom there. This fill is it? it? These are onion straws. You know the expensive ones you buy at that famous um, the restaurant? Strings. The strings. The one with the, the onion accent? Strings? Yes. Yep, put those in there. Okay, I'm okay. going to pop that down in here. Okay, now we're just going to so pop it down. So what's the purpose of not putting them into the oil? When so the that it doesn't splatter. So you've got oh, that well, hello. splash card. Yeah, it doesn't become that. Heard, uh, frying tip. <laughs> it doesn't become that hot mess that we're all used to with a fryer, right? Everything splatters. I did not know. Now you have the, the clear guard. You can actually sit there and look inside there, peek inside there. You can open up the lid there a little bit, and you're doing it the safe way. You're doing well, wait it a minute. the right Listen, way. This is the most important thing that Kelly just educated us all on, is that when you take shrimp or chicken or anything you put into a frying pan and you put it into hot oil, you're going right to hot oil yep. versus settling it in slowly. So when the moisture hits the oil, you know what happens. Yep. Splash! Like these are done, I think. They, no, maybe not. They're almost done. They're very crispy. You okay. can see I just pulled out my fried pickles. To me, there is nothing better on the planet than a fried pickle. Have you ever had a fried, fried pickle? No, fried but pickles it, I are think there's something better delicacy. than a fried pickle. He's going for the French fry. French fry. Anybody surprised? You know, <laughs> We're going to do, how about homemade chips? How many homemade, homemade tortilla chips? Chip. You just. Well, yeah. I think this is nice because, you know, it's nice and light. I mean, for those of you that are seniors that want to mm -hmm. be able to do some fried things once in a while because you want to have fun. How difficult is it for some of those bigger fryers for you to do it with two hands? Over 145 already spoken for. This is the first presentation of the Bella uh, 3.5 liter deep fryer, and it is smoking hot, no pun intended. <laughs> Literally. Look what we've made. Donuts. We've made egg rolls, homemade french fries. I mean, these delicious coconut shrimp chicken tenders that are perfectly golden brown. There are no hot spots. Now you've got the green beans. We did the fried green beans, wings. fried pickles. Oh. I just popped in. We're going to do our own fried tortilla chips. How about mm. doing your own chips? This is just a corn tortilla. That's all it is. Pop it on in your oil. Make sure you're doing it the right way with the fryer. It just makes life easier. And it's a sleek, small footprint. It's not taking up a huge thing. You're not using too much oil. You're not using a whole big old vat of oil. It's a really nice size for two or for 22. I mean, if you just keep going and going, you can see all the food we've already done here. You we've see, you just taught me something food. new. So are you telling me that tortilla chips are just tortillas that are cut up and put into hot oil? I hate to burst your bubble. I thought there you was some like magic home. machine <laughs> that made tortilla <laughs> chips in the Mexican restaurant or no. that they had to package. So they're just tortilla. They're just tortilla. Tortillas yes. that are cut up and, and fried. So well, look at our onion, our fried onion wow. straws. This is like that one you see at the, like I mentioned, the restaurant that you go and pay, pay all that money for. But look at the onion straws. Look how beautiful. These are almost finished. That's why I'm leaving them in there for a few more minutes. But these are to be crispy and crunchy. You can do your own if you just want to get out a batter and batter up your own fresh onions. Okay, I'm making some more chicken strips. Yeah, throw the chicken just strips because on inside. I can. And these are frozen? Yeah, these are from frozen. And remember, because we have such a high-powered fryer, high-powered motor, it's actually going to recover very, very fast. So you can pop in chicken strips after you reveal donuts. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I'm going to have a donut when done. we go to break. But listen, in the meantime, stay right where you are. If you're in the ordering process, this is the lowest price fryer I can ever remember yes. presenting. And at $39.99, you get home on two flex payments. For